All right, Jen St. Dennis back with us from Business in Vancouver. And we mentioned last hour you were talking about Canfor, and they've acquired another company. That's right, yeah. They've, uh, Canfor has acquired uh, yet another U.S. Uh, sawmill in the southern United States, this one in Mississippi. Now, this is uh, the latest in a string of acquisitions that not just Canfor, but a lot of other big B.C. forestry companies like Interfor and West Fraser uh, have been making in the southern United States. Uh, this trend started way back in 2006, but um, more companies have kind of come on board since then, Interfor making its first moves uh, sort of last year, and it really shows no sign of stopping. Now, the reason behind this move, this trend, is really uh, the mountain pine beetle here in B.C. B.C. forests, of course, were really decimated by the mountain pine beetle epidemic that swept through the province in the, in the early 2000s. And we're still really starting to see the effect of that now as B.C. timber companies uh, really are experiencing this timber supplies shortage caused by that uh, that plague of beetle coming through the province, and that's expected to continue for the next few decades. So they're looking for more timber, they're looking elsewhere, and they're finding that in the southern United States. Now, uh, these moves also put them closer to the U.S. home building market, physically closer, and that's also a big be business benefit for them. Steve? All right, there you have it. Okay, Jen, thanks very much for that.